Are you finding it difficult to install popular apps onto your Pi as every app seems to have a different process for installation? Do you want a simple app store just like we have on our mobile devices that installs any app within a single click? Well, then this video is for you. In this video, we'll be setting up Pi apps, which is an open source app store for the Raspberry Pi. So let's get started. Pi apps is an open source app store that comes with a graphical user interface with which you can easily install your favorite apps with just a single click. In this case, I'll be using the Brainy Pi as I don't have the access to the latest Raspberry Pi as they are mostly out of stock these days. So let's get straight to our Pi and set it up. So here we are logged in onto our Brainy Pi. I have done a VNC connection uh, via my PC and uh, this is the GitHub repository that we are going to use, uh, which is the Pi apps. Uh, you can find this in the link in the description below. Uh, and once you're headed there, there is only one command that you need to run in the terminal to install this uh, app store. And as you can see, there are over 200 apps and you can view the list of all the apps out here. And it continuously gets updated, the app store, and there are new apps being added. So you can just uh, look out the app store to, you know, install whichever apps that you like and, you know, check it out. So we are going to run this command. So all you need to do is click on this uh, button to copy the uh, installation uh, uh, script and then just right click and click on paste in the terminal. So this is we are just getting the uh, script bash script and we are piping it through bash and just hit enter and this should start all the installation process. So as you can see the installation is done and it was only one command to install and now we can close the terminal and you can see the icon for the Pi apps has been added to our desktop so we can just double click that as a normal browser you know app and it will open the Pi apps so I can just click on execute. So this will open a GUI for us and we can just explore all the apps out here. So I click on all apps. So to install an app, you just need to double click the application over here and it will open a different uh, screen and you just click on install. So this will install Arduino ID for us. It will do all the scripting stuff. And there we have, it has installed the Arduino ID for us uh, within a few clicks and we can just view it on the desktop itself. There you can see in the programming section it has installed the Arduino IDE for us. So you can connect some Arduinos to your Raspberry Pi as well and uh, do some amazing stuff. Let's take a look at the other apps that we have in the, in the Pi apps. So we have Better Chromium. You also have Discord. You also get FileZilla FTP client. You also get the Minecraft java edition so you can also install minecraft from here and there is also a minecraft java server from here so if you want to host a minecraft server onto your pi then you can also do it via this script you also get the visual studio code so i'll just click on install and it will install visual studio code for me and there we go visual studio code has been installed I'll just open this Visual Studio code to show it. Now you can finally code into your favorite text editor on your Pi. So that's how you install your favorite apps onto your Pi within a few clicks. You can consider subscribing to the channel as we put cool and awesome tech content like this every week. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in another video.